Welcome to another episode of Cabinet Cocktails. My name is Rhea Alexif. I do also host another show called Barrel Side Chats. So if you haven't seen Barrel Side Chat, please be sure to uh, look that up on YouTube or any one of our social media channels. Watch that one. I host that one with my good friend Anna Rose Carter, and you can find her on all kinds of social media as well. So now we have for us a submission. Ah, this one comes from Valerie. Valerie, you've, okay, you've got a nice little alcohol cart there. Uh, plenty of things on there. And then, okay, second photo here. Looks like you've got uh, lots of juices, lots of lemonades. Hey, life gives you lemonade. Drink it. And uh, apparent, that's a lot of lemonade. Was this like a COVID stock up? What happened to you guys? So uh, I like a little bit of a challenge. Uh, and so it looks like you got that peach whiskey. Uh, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna use, be using that uh, Jim Bean uh, peach uh, whiskey in this cocktail. You've got some OJ in there. Um, orange juice always uh, goes great with a, a good whiskey. And then also you had some basil in that photo. And so I'm gonna use uh, a little bit of that. So let's do this Jim Beam peach whiskey. I am gonna do three quarters of an ounce of that, okay? Because I tasted it earlier. Let's taste a little bit now. God, that is just <clears throat> so peachy. So uh, I'm gonna do about three quarters of an ounce of that, and I'm gonna also do an equal amount of our whiskey war here. You had a maker's mark, that'll do just fine. So use some of that bourbon and just mellow out the peach flavors a little bit because uh, they're a little uh, aggressive. Uh, I'm gonna take some of this basil. I'm only gonna do about half a leaf and I'm just gonna drop it right inside of there. Okay, trust me. All right, so you had some OJ in there. So I'm gonna do a little bit of orange juice as well. Uh, why don't we do this? So we did an ounce and a half total of the whiskey. Uh, why don't we just do a little bit more than that? So I'm gonna do one and three quarter um, OJ. Then we're gonna do some ice. Okay, I'm gonna shake things up a little bit. The reason that I'm doing the basil is because I'm trying to freshen up that peach. Because that peach, uh, peach whiskey, it's a little um, syrupy almost in, in the flavor profile. So. Shake it a little bit more. Oh yeah, glassware. Because I threw that basil in there, I'm gonna need to double strain. Any fine strainer will work, because we don't want any of the actual leaf floating in there, but we do want the flavor. Yes! I'm gonna take another one of these basil leaves, a relatively normal size, right? That's a lot, that's a big, big, big basil. You got a lot of big basil. <laughs> so stupid. I don't even have any friends. This. Okay. All right, that was made on the fly. I actually think it could stand a little more peach. So I did uh, three quarters of an ounce. I'm at another half ounce. Let's just do it. Sometimes when you're making drinks, you just gotta, you know, you just gotta keep going. You just gotta keep doing it. What I got now is a bar spoon. If you don't have a bar spoon, get yourself a bar spoon, or you can use a normal spoon. You can use a knife. You really can just use anything that fits inside the glass. I mean, not anything. Oh, Valerie. Valerie, Valerie, Valerie. Guess what I just made for you? Your favorite summer cocktail. Thank you for joining us on Cabinet Cocktails. Well, until next time, no, this is gone. If you liked that episode of Cabinet Cocktails, be sure to like and subscribe and share and go to YouTube and other social media outlets and tell your friends and tell your grandmother because I'm sure she'd love a cocktail too. Out of her cabinet, send me a photo.